So the idea behind the space elevator is it would let us leave the fuel on Earth and make access to space way more inexpensive and way more affordable. Take a string and tie it to the Earth somewhere near the equator and then stretch it out for like 100,000 kilometers and tie the other end to a rock. Then that whole assembly just swings around the Earth like a ball on the end of a string. And then you can run elevator cars up and down that cable. It's an incredible project here, you know, a NASA competition. It's, a, it's NASA. So there's two parts to that challenge. One is actually building that string, and then the other part is being able to send power to these elevator cars so you can actually leave your fuel on Earth. That's what we're working on with the laser power beaming project. Last year, the requirements were 100 meters at 2 meters per second. This year, we have to climb 10 times higher and two and a half times as fast. NASA is really interested in it for powering high altitude blimps for monitoring the Earth's climate. And it's also got applications for Mars exploration and lunar exploration. It's uh, definitely revolutionary at this point in time. I'd love to think that this is the final frontier and we're explorers on it. We're on 2700 RPM. It's not like school with, you know, you get your little assignments and stuff. It's uh, more of a real life challenge with uh, integrated systems, you know, different kinds of engineers. I know the payoff's going to be worth it. It's a once in a lifetime opportunity.